In this lesson, we will attempt the quiz activity as student 1 and then grade the quiz as teacher. So, switch to Google Chrome now. Notice that we are logged in as student 1. By attempting the quiz as student, you will get a fair idea about how the student interacts with the quiz and how different settings translate to the students. Navigate to the third week of the course and click on the demo quiz. Click Attempt Quiz Now. The confirmation window warns you that only two attempts are allowed. Click on Start Attempt. Now you can see the quiz interface area with quiz navigation block, representing easy navigation for the questions. The Finish Attempt option will submit your answers and mark it as one attempt. Besides the question area, a small block gives the number of the question including its status, whether answered, unanswered or flagged, the number of marks the question carries, and an option to flag the question for later reference. Notice that as questions are set to shuffle randomly, you may not get the question in same sequence as shown here. Order of questions may change, although questions remain same. So attempt questions in your exercise accordingly. For the short answer type question, what is sun? Enter the answer, sun is a heavenly body which revolves around the earth. For the essay type question, enter the answer, as shown. You can also copy the content from the file located in file repository and paste it here. Also, notice that HTML editor is not available to students. Click next to see next questions. For the true false type question. Is apple red in color? Select true. For the calculated type question, add x and y, and enter the answer. Click next to view further questions. Match the right options for the matching type question, as shown. And for the MCQ type question, select Tuesday as the answer. Then click next. On summary attempt page click, submit all and finish. Notice the warning that you cannot change your answer once you submit this attempt. Click Submit All and Finish. After submitting the quiz, you can review your attempt. Under Quiz Navigation, you can see wrong answers are reflected by red color, while right answers are reflected in green color. The question with no color represent an ungraded questions. You can see all question on a single page or review one page at a time. Moreover, you can see the correct answer and marks awarded for each question. After reviewing, click on Finish Review button under Quiz Navigation to finish. On this page, you can see your actual marks and grade awarded for attempt. You can also re-attempt the quiz. Note that, you have not been given any grades as yet. This is because the essay type question require manual grading which we will do as a teacher. Switch to Firefox now and log in as teacher to review and grade the quiz. Note that, now we are logged in as admin user. Scroll down. And click on Demo Quiz. The Attempt 1 link denotes that a student has attempted the quiz. Click on Attempts. On this page, you have certain viewing options and the scorecard of the lone attempt of the quiz. Here you can see student's name, email, time of starting, time of completion and scores allotted for each question. If you look at the entry for essay type question, you will find the link which says requires grading. Let's click on the link. A pop-up window will open where you can read the essay to grade it. Scroll down a bit. And click make comment or override mark to give marks for the question. On the new pop-up window, again scroll down and enter the comment, good work, and enter the marks for it. Note that you cannot allow marks greater than the maximum marks allowed. Further scroll down, and click save to save marks and comment for the question. Now close the pop-up window. The colors in the scorecard also convey some information. Red means completely wrong answer and hence zero marks. Green means completely right answer and hence full marks whereas yellow means partially correct answer and hence lower than full marks, but not zero. Scroll down to reveal the graph for the student's attempt. Here, we can see that student 1 has scored between 80 and 85 marks. Now, switch to Google Chrome and refresh the grade window for student 1. 
you will find that the grapes are now allotted and visible for all questions. Now, open your Moodle site in your computer and implement the exercise before proceeding to the next video.